Alright, hello guys and welcome back in my channel. In this video I will show you the locations of all the Lumen Spar so you can uh, collect them and level up your gadget which is a Lumen Stone Adjuvant. Now about uh, this item, this is uh, mainly from the World Quest, uh, yeah I got this one from uh, World Quest Reward so I don't, on the map you can't find it, at least uh, for now I didn't find anyone. Also I will divide the video into different parts, so in different chapters, so you can just slide the video uh, to, yeah, to watch the part you need. If possible, try to follow my same steps, it will be a lot easier, and uh, yeah, let's just uh, go. Okay, so after you go to the Chasma, when you come here, you will be teleported into this, te this teleport waypoint. This first one is, uh, you can get it immediately with the World Quest when you come down to the Chasma. Basically, you will find it around here. Anyways, uh, the second one is uh, there, so just uh, jump down. And you will see this uh, Guru, yeah, Guru should be. And it's just uh, on the end of this uh, thingy. Collect it, Lumen Spar. After you got this one, don't care about those stones because they those are just uh, the jade. Go inside this tunnel you see here. Once you're here, watch down, fly, and go to this part. You can see there's a platform. If you fall to down instead of climbing, you can just go to on this stone. And the jump to it. Really, really useful. Go to this cave. We see an enemy. I will just ignore for, uh, ignore him for now. No need to fight. You will see the next one, which is here. Here we go. This gate, we still cannot access it, so just don't care about it. Now, go outside. Go back and go outside from this cave. And fly down. You will see the the next one here. Okay, collect this one. Perfect. And keep go outside. You will see a slime. Just ignore him. Go down. Activate your teleport waypoint. I guess you already activated it. If you're uh, at my at this point of the game. Next one is on the road here. Now keep following my steps, go on this uh, ladder and climb it. You will see it uh, just here at the end of this cave. Here we go. Now fly down. This direction, you will see the next one here, on the top of this uh, wood, broken uh, broken groove. Collect this one as well. Okay, and keep follow this uh, path. Next step, you have to activate this uh, teleport waypoint if you didn't activate it yet. Also, if you ask me how I got my map. Like why I can see the map uh, like this uh, is because I completed the world quest, uh, the first one uh, uh, that uh, which uh, that you come down. After you complete that one, uh, you will unlock uh, yeah the, this part of the map. Anyways, just to keep climb. Next one is just here. The kit and climb here. Now, don't touch the ceiling. I mean, if you want, you can touch, but uh, yeah. Activate this teleport waypoint. After you activate the teleport waypoint, go here, downside, just here. What you have to do here, just climb this. 
Here you have to be careful. If you're on PC, it will be easier, but on the phone you can do the same. Go on this uh, thingy, and you can start to walk. Watch in front of you. Make sure that your character and DC is on a straight line. Keep a walk. Don't run. Keep a walk. When you come out to the end, jump and climb. Here we go. After you got this one, just teleport back to the teleport waypoint I told you to activate. You can get this one by uh, doing the same step as well, but no need, since we can, if you want a more simple road uh, plan to follow, just follow me. Come on top side. Okay. Now go across this bridge. Here we see that one. That's why if you take that one, it will be harder to you, for you to reach here. So just uh, come here. Here inside, uh, yeah, you can access to it, but uh, it's uh, still dark. So I will count this as a uh, next uh, area. So the next part. Okay, once you're here, be careful because there is a hole uh, here, so don't uh, fall. Just uh, come here and take it. Once you took this one, you can jump down and take this one now. Okay, once you took this one, go here. Toward this uh, small lake. You will see the next one in the center of this lake. Here we go. And after you took this, jump down from here. To take the next one, which is here, inside of this, uh, this, this thingy. Alright, after you, uh, if you ask why I got uh, the map unlocked uh, even more, because I did some progress uh, with the mission, because actually for the first part you don't need um, to increase the level, but when you reach this point, you have to, yeah, when you reach this point, you have to absolutely increase your level of your gadget. By the way, after you collect this one, just uh, teleport back to this separate waypoint. There is another way to come back uh, to this position, but you have to climb, uh, and uh, I guess you don't like climbing, so that's just a walk. Just to go back to that uh, position on the top side and get inside uh, to the tunnel. You already been here when you was doing the yeah the same mission no. The previous mission, which asks you to complete the two side uh, small quest to come inside when it was uh, come inside here, and you will see a new character with the hydro bow, but we still don't know the name. Anyways, after you come inside, there is one. Collect uh, this. After you got this one, just to keep progress, uh, keep walk uh, deeper in the tunnel. And when you are at the end of the tunnel, you will see this um, teleport waypoint, just activate it. And near to the uh, waypoint, you will see another Lumino bar. Lumen bar. Once you got this one, watch the downside, jump down, you will see another one. There is an enemy as well, but let's don't care about him for now. This one. Get it. And... Go to this platform, jump to here, there's another platform. Jump again to top side. When you reach here, basically, uh, that is the teleport waypoint. When you reach here, keep walking in front of you, you will see the another one. Here we go. If we go to our top side, now when you reach here, turn left. You will see another this uh, boost uh, rock. Get it. Go inside this tunnel now, and there's uh, the last one for this uh, part of the map. But now don't uh, get out first uh, because. Uh, okay. Okay. After you collect this one, don't go out yet. Keep good progress uh, in the tunnel because actually the, this tunnel is linked to the first uh, cave uh, of the map. So just uh, keep going. You will see this uh, rock, just to destroy it. And we basically linked uh, yeah, those two parts of the map. 
So here is a link. After you did this one, you can teleport back to this teleport waypoint. To teleport here, just follow my steps and walk toward this um, this direction to get to this one, which is uh, downside here. You can see it. Okay, perfect. After you got this one, go down, fly down. You will see this one. So basically, just to follow the route uh, the game made for you. Okay, gotten this one, keep go downside, fly toward this platform first. Why this platform first? Uh, this only if you didn't unlock the teleport waypoint yet. So you can come here, activate the teleport, teleport waypoint. After you activated the teleport waypoint, you can go back to this part of the map and get this one. You can skip uh, this step if you already collect, uh, activated it. Get this one, after you got this one, fly downside to that one, this one. Okay, now watch toward the north side and go inside this uh, weird tunnel you see always on the north side. Just ignore all the enemies, if you can, try to avoid the mag. That portal, uh, yeah, you cannot access yet because you need at least, uh, yeah, the, to increase the level of the gadget. You see this one on the lake, right? Just to collect it. Okay, really nice. Now, don't go away yet. You can directly go take this one instead of walking here because, uh, yeah, let's make it uh, one uh, one route only. Just to swim a bit. There is a slime and don't care about it. Go top side here. First time, if it is the first time you come here, you will probably be scared. Why? Because there is a GOV shape. There is a wall first. GOV shape will break the wall and uh, gives you a jump scare. Basically this wall here. Okay, come out from this tunnel, you will see this uh, Lumen Spa. Now, gotten this, keep going. This side. There is another one, but we cannot access to it yet, since... Uh, yeah, I still didn't found a way to enter this gate. Once I get it, uh, yeah, we will probably be yeah, later. Anyway, skip follow the mountain, you will see the next one on this side, basically on the east direction. Okay, perfect. Now, teleport back to this teleport waypoint. Watch toward the um, southeast, basically on this uh, platform downside of the teleport waypoint, you can already see it. But the if you, if it's the first time you go there, there is no the mud uh, first. When you get close enough, the mud will spawn together with the whipper flower, so be careful. Anyways, that does, this doesn't influence anything, so just go there, ignore everything, take that. Come as far, and run away. Run away toward this mountain, always on the southeast direction. Climb a bit. Take it. Now watch it downside toward that camp on the south direction and just take it. Perfect. Got in this, uh, watch toward the south ovest. You will see. Yeah, the next one just right there. Really easy to notice. This gate is already open for me because I did the progress with the um, world quest, um, the heavy list on uh, the wrist. Um. So you can just, uh, yeah, just to progress, uh, just to do your world quest until this part, uh, until you cannot access anymore unless you level up your gadget. Once you did this, you can follow the, yeah, it's better if you follow the guide after you completed that. Anyways, get this one, go inside this, uh, mega, uh, this, this, uh, how is it called, the storage, and you will find this one. Now, next step is to teleport to this teleport waypoint, and... Uh, you will see immediately here it uh, on this groove. So yeah, just to come here and walk uh, toward the top side of the groove. Get the lumen spar and watch it toward the uh, east direction. East direction, jump down. There is another one on yeah, always on this groove on a on a special of groove. If you 
You can fly directly to it. If you, you cannot, just climb a bit this grew and jump down. Once you got this, don't go away first. Climb here. Climb here. And you will see this fatty camp, right? You have to go this side, so just jump down. This part of the map is one of my favorite of the Chasma. Just uh, climb here. Basically, yeah, this silly will get you to there, but I will not follow her yet because uh, it will be included in the chest video. So, once you come here, this is a really, really beautiful uh, place. So you will see a wall with uh, basically geo barrel. Just to use a, a, any character to destroy the barrel, the wall will be destroyed. And you will enter in this beautiful place. And uh, here you will find uh, the um, Lumen Spar. If you want, you can go yeah, inside to explore a bit. Guys, yeah, really, really beautiful, you can see. With a really cute dendro slime. Anyways, after this, you can teleport back to this teleport waypoint. So basically, walk toward this uh, cave. On the ovest, ovest direction. Oh yeah, actually for Yen is west, not ovest. Ovest, ovest is Italian. <laughs> yeah, west then. On the west direction. On this lake you will immediately see this one. First time you come here you will accept a world quest, which is yeah from the Fatwis. I made a video about that as well. Anyways, collect this. Keep going inside the tunnel. And you will see this underground waterway, another beautiful place. And once you're here, you will immediately notice this one on the top of this fallen tree. Just to go take it. Perfect. Watch it toward that direction. You see that wall, right? That wall is brickable, but not from here. I will explain later. Yeah, it's not really important, but if you want to connect those two parts of the map, later I will show you. Now fly toward the north direction on this platform, flying platform. Ignore enemies. Okay, here. Jump toward this direction and fly a bit, then climb a bit. Okay, once you're upstairs, go to this the platform, watch it toward this tree, okay, so basically always north direction, climb a bit more to go to the next platform, jump again, and you will be on the top side. Instead of uh, teleporting back, then walk, uh, yeah, it, this is faster. Once you're here, you will see the next lumen spar. Take it. Go deeper in the cave. Okay, once you're here, if you want, you can go top side first. Why top side? Because you can connect those two parts of the map. You see this uh, thingy? Just uh, make it explode. You see? You basically connected this part uh, yeah, here. This part and uh, on the ground here. We already explored here, so yeah, it's not really important, but uh, just to, for you to connect the map. Anyways, once you side here, there is another moment spar. Collect this one. You see this really big place, right? You see this gate, right? But we cannot access to it yet, so we, we will come back here later using this labor web. Anyways, now go toward the south direction. Toward this challenge, time limited challenge. In the corner of this cave, take, you will find the next. Next step, I guess if you already unlocked the world quest until here, you should already have the teleport waypoint unlocked. But I will simulate you didn't unlock it, so teleport just back to this one and walk inside it. Also, this is to unlock, uh, to connect the two caves later. Let me just uh, jump down from the uh, south direction. This uh, gate you opened with the cannon. This chest, just ignore it. I don't need to lock it. Now, here. There's no lumen spar, but if you go to this cave... And if you go to the end... You will see again this thing. Just to make it explode. 
to connect the two part of the map. Not really important, but uh, just for you to know, uh, just to let you know you can do this. Now back to the main road. We see this uh, giant uh, Jovi shape screaming, just ignore. Okay, keep going the tunnel, ignore the silly. We'll find uh, this one uh, on uh, this uh, special of uh, re refuge, yeah. Okay, safe house. Take the lumen spar, keep go deeper. Unlock the teleport waypoint. And the downside here. Here we see immediately one. Perfect. Now, last the three remain. First one is here, you can already see it on this grow again. So just go down. No need to climb. Go to this platform to, f to jump really, really high. Jump, get it. Then uh, fly toward the south direction. You will see another jump of, uh, jump platform here. Okay, here. Jump, take this one. Now watch toward the southwest direction. You see that uh, jumping platform here? Go toward it. Approach. Next one is here, you can see, on the northwest direction. So, jump tower, jump, open the glide and fly to it, instead of climbing. This is faster. And we collected all the lumen spar, at least for me, that I found. This is the first half map of the Chasm underground mines. Also, let me see how many we collect. 43, guys, 43. Let's go to Jingu, Jingu and upgrade it. Refine that you want. Okay, let's enhance. Perfect. One unlocked. This one is a reward from a world quest. So you should have it. So enhanced to the second level. And enhanced to the fifth level. Now we cannot anymore because we need another Lumenstone Ore. At least on the map I didn't find any. So probably it's a reward from another world quest. Okay. After you, do, after you did this... Please uh, go continue to do your world quest first uh, and uh, come back to check the video for the second part after you're stuck uh, because you needed to, yeah, for the level 2. Alright guys, for this one I just uh, figured it out. Basically you have to first uh, uh, find the treasure map first, which is, uh, okay, disappeared because I just used it. Basically, yeah, you have to find the two pieces of the treasure map. You can check my other video of the treasure map of the Chasma. Basically one piece you can find it here. At the treasure hoarder camp. Other one is after, uh, is here on this place. Basically, this point, this is a treasure hoarder camp. After you got those two pieces of the map, it will form a full map uh, treasure map, indicating you that you can go to this point only after you got the map first, because else you cannot access. Come here, burn the grass thingy, and there is a gate. Enter into the gate, you will be able to go inside this cave. From inside the cave, you will be able to open the gate. If you don't know how to do this, just watch my other guide um, of the treasure map. And uh, yeah, just go here and take the luminous, luminous bar. Alright guys, uh, I, yeah, I progressed with the world quest, so I unlocked more part of the map. But anyways, at this point of the map, so after you defeated the world quest, you will find here something glowing. Also, after you finish the world quest, if you come here, you will get this, uh, the next stone, uh, Lumen Stone Ore. This is needed to increase the level from 5 to 6, so remember to take it. So, after you got this device, this uh, ore, let's continue. Just jump down into this um, abyss. Here, you will see immediately one floating. Just to get this one. Here we go. And uh, fall... Just try to don't die, of course. I fall down and activate this teleport waypoint. First time you come here, you will trigger the um, Ar Archon Quest as well, if you're already at this point of the Archon Quest, of course. And uh, yeah, after you activated this teleport waypoint, follow this path. We're going to the castle first. 
I know there is a teleport waypoint, but for who doesn't unlock the teleport way waypoint yet, just do my same steps. I'm here. Inside. Use this rope to climb. Okay. Go out from this... Um, Gate. If you want, you can follow the Sealy. Yeah, just to, just to follow the road. I I must keep the Sealy for the other guide, so yeah, I will just uh, take the shortcut. You can just uh, use the rocks to come here. Now, go inside this room, and you will see there's a teleport, uh, a flipper teleport waypoint. Uh, this is a bit bugged because even if you get close enough here, it's uh, hard to activate it. So you have to basically climb this tree to activate it. Activate it from here. Yeah, just to try a bit. After you activated that one, so come here, jump, and fly to that platform. If you are not sure, you can go from uh, the mid uh, building as well. Up to you. Okay, now use this pillar. Go to here. Okay. Climb here. Outside from here, use the tree, the wood, to reach that part of the map. And the downside here, you will find the next one. Perfect. After you got this one, go here. Reach the center point first. Oh my god. Alright, never mind, you can go there from, from here as well. Just to jump down, fly to the center, this building here. Here we go. Once you took this one as well, fly toward this teleport waypoint because we're gonna follow this route. The others just don't care about them because this is one route. Yeah, you can see it from here. Now, after you got to this one, go inside this tunnel directly. Yeah, don't care about anything else. Okay. At this point, be careful, don't jump yet. This looks scary, but it's actually pretty easy to explore. Just jump to this platform. There is one first. You can see. Take it. Be careful to those rocks. Now, what you have to do is to go activate the teleport waypoint there. To fly directly to it. Okay, activate the teleport waypoint so we can teleport here later. Now, what you have to do is to go back to the base, the campment, and level up your lumen, lumen spar adjuvant. You can see we can do it because, yeah, we got enough and we have the lumen or ore from the world west. So, enhance. Now we are able to destroy the level 2 Ozin concretion. Now teleport back. Okay, here we go. <laughs> you destroy this uh, gate already now. Yeah, get more close. You will open this. And inside here, you will find uh, another one. So yeah, just to get closer, more closer. Here, hide it here. Ah, thanks. Okay, next step from here, fly to the bridge. Deck that one. Here we go. We took this one. If you want to kill this enemy first, but I will just ignore. And go to this pillar to take this one. Okay, go to the top. And you can take this one, just a jump. Once you're here, go to the top side, you will see another one here. So just jump and glide to here. Keep climbing. <laughs> Okay, once you're here, take it. Here we go. Now, the next step is to jump down till there. Actually, you can just use the teleport waypoint. So just teleport back. Jump down. 
kill this part and between those rocks there is one get it and now go to this corner you will see those uh, gems uh, the crystals don't care about them go on this uh, floating thingy jump on the upside you see this this purple uh, purple <coughs> tunnel right go inside this purple tunnel toward the west and there is another one here we go this part is done as well so first of all those are the last I mean, there are two routes uh, actually actually three routes but uh, is actually really easy to follow so first of all teleport to this teleport waypoint you activated before the reversed one and jump down from here jumping down go toward these um, rocks uh, this uh, yeah this mountain i don't know how to call it so when you're here on the right side uh, so on the west direction uh, northwest uh, you will see this one just here so immediately take this one after you took this one watch toward that side that is the next one okay here we go take this one and now, since on this road there's nothing, we can just go to this one, uh, going toward our base. So we have to take uh, this, uh, basically, um, this road, go, the one going upstairs. And uh, on this corner you will see this one as well. Here we go. And now, depends. If you already activated the teleport waypoint, just teleport to there. Else, uh, yeah, walk a bit, uh, go there and activate it. But I guess, uh, yeah, you act already activated this. If you followed uh, my same progress uh, and you did the world west, uh, just like me. And you will see this one right here, really, really close to the waypoint. After you got to this one, just teleport back to this teleport waypoint. We're gonna follow the, yeah, basically one of the last routes. Once you're here, Watch toward the north side, jump down from this uh, hole, and go toward this tunnel. Always uh, yeah, a bit uh, toward the west, so northwest. If you watch in front of you, on that pillar, you will see the next. Uh... Now, go in this one, uh, keep go toward this uh, direction. Of the tunnel, yeah, just keep following the tunnel. Ignore this uh, ring grader, he cannot follow you. Okay, go toward this uh, building. And if it, the first time you come here, this gate will uh, automatically open and there's an enemy just to kill him. Also, activate this uh, how it's called, um, this uh, teleport waypoint and climb toward the top side. No, not from here, sorry. The other wall, climb to our top side of this building, and right behind you, you will see the next one. Collect this as well, jump down, don't, you see that one, but uh, yeah, let's don't care about it then, uh, yet. Just go toward this direction, yeah, you have to climb this waterfall. Once you're upstairs, oh my god, stupid mage. Don't care about this mage, go here, you will see this um, jumping tower, right? Jump toward that side. Okay, we're here. Once you're here, you can see there's another jump tower, but we cannot reach that uh, luminous part. So you have to use a Nemo character to trigger this, and then you can fly to it. Okay, once you're here. Just stop gliding, you will take it. Once you took this one, go to the waterfall. Here. Waterfall. Plunge attack to, to destroy this rock. It's just uh, hiding here. Uh, cannot reach it. Uh, actually, I got it. Yeah, if you cannot reach, just uh, climb a bit and then jump down. Okay, after you go to this one, go. Climb this direction. Okay, toward the so southwest. Okay, deal with that. Uh, it's fine. Climb a bit more, and you will be able to reach this one we saw before. Jump. Okay. 
Now the next one is on the top of this building. You can already see it, right? Uh, there is uh, some. There are yeah. There are some enemies. Just ignore them. Climb uh, this uh, pillar. Remember that Genshin is still a climb simulator game. Okay, once you got to this one, fly toward sud east. So toward this direction. You will see that uh, ruin, uh, ruin sentinel. Go toward the ruin sentinel, you will see this, this gate. This gate requires a level uh, 6 at least of your gadget. Because it's a level 2 Ozing something something. So just come here. Use your gadget to open the gate. And here inside you will find this one. And a precious chest. But we are not here to collect the chest yet. Get your... Get your luminous power and keep following this tunnel. You will see a glow point. Don't care about it yet. Now you will see a fishing pool. Yeah, that's not... Uh... Important, just keep follow the tunnel. We will see a beast hydra bishop mage. Keep go deeper. Once you reach uh, this point, you will see this, uh, yeah, this uh, luminous part on that uh, small pillar. Just to go take it. Okay, you got this one. Yeah, there are no more on the top side, guys. Now, this waterfall is connected to the bottom side, bottom part of this map, the glowing narrows. So, yeah, just a fall here. Just a fall down, no need to worry. Fall, 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 fall. Ah, here we go, you can see he's connected. So once you're downside, go toward this mushroom. Here you go. This one is the next we have to collect. And turn on your left side, so toward the south direction, you will see the next one in that small lake. Collect this one. Here is our friend Katarina, let's don't care about her yet. Now go toward this uh, teleport waypoint if you didn't activate it yet, but I guess, uh, yeah, I, I bet you already did, did it as a good explorer. Once you reach here, you will see this uh, Geovishay, we don't care about him. Turn on your left side, so toward uh, south east. And you will see here, near, yeah, on those uh, woods, uh, the next one. Climb a bit. Okay. Here we go. Now. Uh, here follow a bit the wood to go on the right side from this small tunnel. Yeah, this this small uh, waterfall. Near to those uh, crystal. And get to the next one. Here we go. Now just to keep follow the tunnel because there are no more... Um, only on those uh, on this mushroom. Our friend, uh, how it's called, Xa 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 something. Xamaran. Uh, climb uh, Xamaran. Okay, you can see how we are here. So climb a bit more. Oh my god, so glowy. Okay, um, so hard. Yeah, here is a bit tricky. Try a bit. Okay, here we go. Yeah, try a bit. And you can get this one. Here we go. What to do now? Teleport back to this teleport waypoint. Just to watch toward the uh, west direction. And uh, go inside it. If you do the main world quest of uh, the, um, the Chasma. The Chasma, actually. No, it's not the Chasma, Chasma. Chasma. You will see this uh, or glowing ore. That is the ore we need to level up our gadget. And uh, in front of it, in front of you, you will also see a luminous bar. Just collect this one and collect this ore as well. I mean, you could already collect it when you were, you were, you were doing the world quest, but I left it so we can collect it uh, together. Anyways, now just keep follow the tandem. You will reach this part, which is a yeah a canyon. You can call it. Drop down. Just drop down. You will see an enemy. This is Serpent's, uh, the Serpent's Guard, I don't know how to call it, this mob, but uh, yeah, this one. And you will see this... Uh, okay. Thing just in front of him. Steal from him. And run away. Go to the end of this tunnel, turn on your right side, and keep follow. Go deeper. 
near to the end of this uh, cavern, you will see the next one, just here, sitting there. Really easy to notice. Now go toward this uh, beautiful gate. And uh, here we go, teleport waypoint. Activate it, but I bet you already activated it. Same for that teleport waypoint, I bet. This one as well. But uh, let's simulate you didn't activate it yet. Now, what to do? You can already see it there. So, just to follow the path toward it. Also above us, there is another one on this bridge, but uh, we cannot reach it yet if you don't have the teleport waypoint. Just take this one, keep follow this uh, bridge. You will see this smaller ruin. Uh, you should already know what is, uh, what is this used for. Once you're here, uh, this is, uh, yeah, I put this one here because of the quest task at me. Anyways, once you're here, just, uh, yeah, fly and reach this part of the, this stone, this rock, actually. Right, go in front of you, you will see the next, uh, the next, uh, how is it called, uh, luminous spar. This luminous, if you already activated this teleport waypoint, uh, you can just teleport here and uh, jump through there to get it. Nice. Now, next one, from the teleport waypoint, turn toward the southwest direction. Keep walk, follow this last uh, pillar, this last rock. You will see one hiding here in the dark. Here is really, really dark. Here we go. Now, only one remain. Since you activated the teleport waypoint, just teleport back. Face on the northeast direction. Fly down. So this is a small part. You will also see those glowing things. Once you overpass this gate, you can already see it on this bridge, the stone bridge. Theory, we got all those, now the only one remain, let me count, for now should be 31. In fact, 31. We need one last to get 32, which is a multiple of 8. Last one is here, here. so just to teleport back to this teleport waypoint. Yeah, once you once you teleported here, just to go toward the, 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 the cave, so this direction, north, northwest. You will also see this glowing thing, just don't care about it for now, I will make the guide for it as well. It's a world quest. Okay, once you're here, ignore those uh, treasure hoarders. Okay, when you're here, guys, when you hear the first time, there is a gate, just like that one. You, you have to use your gadget, so just here, press Z, at least level 6 of the gadget, and the door, the gate will open. Once you open the gate, just go inside. And take this uh, reward, which is a luminous spar. No, lumen spar. Since you're here, you can activate this gate as well. Just press Z in front of the gate, and here we go. Now we have all the lumen spar. Let's teleport to the encampment, the main encampment, and here talk to Jingwu and level up our adjuvant. So enhance to level seven. Enhance to level 8, which requires one of the ore as well. Enhance to level 9, as you can see, no ore is needed anymore. And enhance to level 10. Here we go. Really, really nice, guys. Dun. Arc Illuminator, so we get the achievement as well. Also, if you still miss one, uh, I, I mean, you shouldn't miss any Lumen Spar because uh, if you follow my guide uh, step by step, you shouldn't miss. Uh, but still, uh, in case you miss, guys, uh, once you reach uh, level 8, uh, the Blobbing Light AoE increased uh, and uh, it, it can now search for the Nerby Lumen Spar when used. You can use this trick to search the missed one, but uh, yeah. As I repeat, if you follow my ste same steps, you shouldn't miss any. So that's all guys, hope this video helped you to collect all the Lumen Spar. Thanks for watching and see you in the next video. Bye!